This video is going to be very important for you guys. When there is a heart problem, a heart attack occurs. When the arteries are blocked, stunts are placed in arteries. However, one out of every seven people has a damaged kidney. When the kidney fails, it doesn't give any indication. To understand the function of the kidney, first we need to understand the food we eat. We eat only three types of foods: carbohydrates, fats, or proteins. Carbohydrates provide us energy and fats control hormones. However, the natural digestion process releases some side products that are handled by our bodies. For instance, carbohydrates released during the digestion of fats and carbs are handled by our respiratory system. However, the digestion of protein is challenging. Reduce your protein intake because your kidneys are involved in digestion of protein. While the proteins in food like eggs and pulses are abundant, but our bodies are able to accept proteins in the form of amino acids. Amino acids are transformed into ammonia by liver. Ammonia is made of nitrogen and hydrogen, and nitrogen is far too toxic. After breaking down the proteins, our liver releases this ammonia into the blood. Now, its kidneys function to throw toxic nitrogen out of our body. This is the reason when you go for a kidney test, doctors first test one, blood urea nitrogen. What is nitrogen? Nitrogen is toxic. Where does it come from? It comes from our diet. Nitrogen from your diet can be reabsorbed in your body, which is extremely toxic. Your kidney's role is to remove toxins from your body. The second thing your doctor checks is your creatinine level. which comes from muscle metabolism rather than nutrition exercise is something i do since it helps muscles be metabolized and grow stronger the by product of the muscles metabolism is creatinine your body cannot reabsorb creatinine if you really want to check your kidneys functioning then check creatinine levels because blood urea nitrogen is not so reliable blood urea nitrogen will reabsorb means if you had protein some time before so the level gets changed while the amount of bun fluctuates the levels of creatinine remain constant therefore the best test to determine whether or not your kidneys are compromised is a creatinine level test the kidney's function is to balance electrolytes means calcium potassium sodium and magnesium that is the reason when your kidney is damaged the doctor advises you to lower down salt intake because salt is an electrolyte that holds water when your kidneys are damaged the body begins to retain water which causes edema where feet and legs get swollen up due to trapped fluid in body's tissues due to the trapped fluid edema causes indentations to remain on the skin after pressure is released You will notice water bags under your eyes and your body appears bloated. That is not fat. Instead, your kidneys are retaining water. When urine tests are done, low levels of salt are diagnosed because their kidneys are retaining salt due to an electrolyte imbalance. When these levels increase, the doctors advise you to reduce your salt intake. The research had shown that dialysis patients when fed less salt Along with ACE inhibitors the bun and creatinine levels were reduced in their blood